Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Don Julio and today I'm gonna be showing you how to unsubscribe from all years on Boyd Workshop add-on so you could play on the server. It's actually a very simple thing to do. So you're getting errors on our server. Uh the best thing to do is clear your workshop add-on. So this is what you want to do. You want to go to your Steam, you're gonna click on your profile, and then you're going to go to your workshop items. Click on subscribed items and now we're going to select the game and do project zomboid and there's this button right here that says un unsubscribe from all you want to click that now I also want to mention if you click everything individually there's a good chance that this won't fix your problem because zomboid uh, if a developer or a workshop creator makes his add-on privated you can't see it in this list but your add-ons will still be uh, active and running, <clears throat> which will give you problems. So always make sure to unsub unsubscribe from all. It's the button. Always click that. Now, another thing is sometimes when you click that, your add-ons don't actually remove. So I'm going to show you how to do that, how to actually make sure they're gone. So what you want to do, you want to go to your settings here. And then go to your, uh, yeah, your downloads your steam library and now you want to go to where your zomboid would be mine is on my two terabyte drive um, project zomboid so this is your game directory we're gonna select this right click copy drag it down into your type and just uh, paste it and go to your library your steam apps <clears throat> and now your workshop you want to delete this file right here the 10860 that's your uh, zomboid uh, workshop file and you also want to go into your content and delete the 10860 folder and this is where all your zomboid mods are going to be so if you unsubscribe from all your mods and these are still in here uh, they will load and if you delete these manually and you're not unsubscribed they will automatically download so uh, yeah if you want to connect uh, to the server and you're having problems make sure uh, you do this and that is how you uh, delete your workshop mod.